along and uh, welcome back to Antidote Couple. So we're giving you our updates about uh, what we've been doing all the time. I know most of you watched our wedding videos. We had a blast wedding. It was really wonderful interracial wedding, African and Thai. If you haven't watched the video, make sure you go back and watch, please. Yeah, so welcome back and uh, we still going to keep you posted on our future videos too. Now it's non-stop, we won't stop uploading videos every weekend. Yeah, so for today's topic... <laughs> every we're weekend. Really, yeah, yeah. We are back, we're fully back. Uh, we bought... Uh, 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 before, like three months ago, we had a problem with um, uh, our laptop. So we had to sacrifice and uh, uh, bought a new one. We are going to ultrasound. For ultrasound, when? When are we going? Are we, we have to start every month. But right now we're going to know. Um, no, no, I'm not sure. My sisters told me if it's a boy, if baby is boy, a boy, four months, you will know gender. Okay. But if it's a girl, it's, it will be more than five, four months. Yeah. So we're not sure yet. I just keep fingers crossed. Let's pray that we're going to know the results of our. Uh, child's gender soon i mean i'm really anxious i really want to know my child's gender and um for now you can guess and uh, leave a comment over here uh comment below if the child is gonna be a boy or a girl maybe you can get a small gift <laughs> you never know and um another thing is that um you can also prepare to give us to 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 give us uh names maybe the best names for our children you know yeah, you can comment too. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of gift? No, no, I, I haven't. I, I didn't stress on that one gift. I said maybe you can get a gift. Okay, we're not sure about that. But if you're correct, I think if you're going to know the child sex, we'll upload a video next weekend. Yeah, because we're going to know on Friday, right? Ultrasound. I'm not sure. Ultrasound I'm not will sure. be. I've told you if it's going to be true, right? If it's going to. If you're going to know the sex, of course you're going to upload next weekend about our child sex. But if it's not, then we have to be patient for um, another. Maybe change the content a little bit. Bought. Uh, what's this? What kind of coffee is this? Latte. We bought latte. Sugar. And you know what she did? She just sipped. She took a sip, just one sip is from here to here and we're sharing for this, we're sharing this, imagine. Oh, I think I I only pay 10 baht for this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you drink a lot. Or do you drink with the baby too? Yeah, I drink. This is the only drink that I shall let, she has but left for me. I should not drink toffee. What should I drink? Why, why do you drink then? And we are in if coffee you're, shop. If you're thirsty, then you have to drink some water or hot water or tea. Yeah, we are at a beautiful uh, coffee shop, and um, this one we have we, we have took uh, we have taken a lot of coffee shop videos. So I think that's that, that's a close content for now. Do you remember the streaming time? Yeah, the streaming time in yeah, the past three months. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I sleep a lot. And I think I throw up a lot. Yeah. What did you help me? <laughs> she used to sleep. I think you took a nap, a long nap. Maybe you take even more than five hours on bed during the day. And most of her evenings, she used to puke, rushing to the washroom every time. You know, I really pitied her because uh, she couldn't eat well. You know. Really, it was really sad. It's not, it wasn't easy even for me. Mood swings too, you know. But um, right now I just feel good because she's feeling better. It's the fourth month. There are no more no, like symptoms or complications right now. Do eh? no. you have any problem right now? No. And another thing I noticed they, I that... I eat a lot. A four months. Uh, we normally eat rice in town, but she didn't like rice at all. Even now, do you still like rice? No. I don't know why. And she likes sugary desserts like a cake, yeah? Yes. What kind of food do you like? Like mostly what kind of food do you eat? No, uh, I usually eat cream, everything, but 
I like jelly or that kid snack. Every time we go for shopping, she buys uh, some desserts, sugary desserts, and then she puts them in the fridge. So she, sometimes she would even skip meals. She doesn't wanna eat. Only she only takes those sugary desserts. And I felt so bad. I'm like my baby eats sugar, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's really bad. Baby like <laughs> Yeah, but right now um, she's okay. And uh, there's a myth, is it a myth or my, um, a belief that when you eat like a lot of, I don't know, sugary food, the baby is going to be a boy or a girl, I don't know, it's going to be, is it true like if you eat a lot of uh, sweets, sweet food? But I like sour too. You like sour? Some That's really weird. Bored. <laughs> So let's wait. I don't know. Anything, I don't have to believe anything that, that people say on the internet. So let's just be patient and wait for wait to know how our child is going to be. It's a boy or a girl. Yeah. So her mom is uh, her mom is really waiting to 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 see our child. She even <laughs> she even gave her some. Baby's clothes yesterday, I'm like, wow, that's too fast. Oh She's the first person to give her <laughs> some presents for her own child, you know. <laughs> Surprised me. Yeah, I was like, mom, why is it too soon? We, we only, we still have five months left down the line. And they're already giving some things for the baby. Another thing that's kind of discouraging me, I've insisted. We are supposed to go for shopping and to buy some maternity dresses, but my wife doesn't like wearing. I don't know why. Don't like and it's not good when you're wearing a t-shirt. In two months, you won't be able to wear this kind of cloth, you know. Because you all of wear something that's all, stretchy, all of kind of stretchy. When they're pregnant in two months, they don't wear. But next month, you have to prepare for that. I have to force up. Oh. Maybe I'm going to go there. I don't know. I don't know how. Mm -hmm. I have to take you there so that you buy, you know. Or I take, I, I buy for you there. You have to choose the kind of dress that you want. You know? So she should change. Because I don't want to see this in two months. It's when gonna, I work, it's gonna, yeah. when you work, sometimes I have to walk in the jungle on field. Mm. If I don't wear pants. Oh, that's understandable because so when you have a field work, you can we can wear two clothes. You just wear the dress, and then when you're going to the field, you can change it. She's a lab technician, and uh, sometimes she has to go to the field. Like, what are you going to wear? I will take some sample. Mm -hmm. So you can wear some boots and uh, trousers on, only on that specific day. But on the other days, during the other days, you have to wear a dress, maternity dress, you know. Can you please do that? <laughs> okay? She thinks like it's kind of... Is it old fashion? No, it's not. Because... No, no, it's not old fashion. No, it's about fashion. But I don't like wear skirts. Wear, no? mm -hmm. You have to do it because you're with me. Okay, that's it for now. Let's wait for next weekend. Yeah, let's wait for baby sex and then I'm gonna tell you. So, ciao ciao everyone. What do you say? I hope you're saying Swahili when you're saying goodbye. Swahili, what do you say? I just say Asana Asana. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Kapumaka. <laughs>